I'm Mike Wilkening. Welcome to the Handicappers Corner on Pro Football Weekly. Let's get right into the big news of the week, the firing of Brad Childress in Minnesota. Now we looked at how interim coaches fared when Wade Phillips was fired in Dallas. Let's take a more in-depth look with Leslie Frazier taking over in Minnesota. For starters, teams led by interim head coaches have struggled from an against the spread perspective in their debuts. These teams are 7-15-1 against the spread since 1990, a 31.8% success rate. We should also mention the recent success of Cowboys interim head coach Jason Garrett, whose team is 2-0 straight up and against the spread since he took over. Certainly Garrett sparked a listless team. Can Frazier do the same? In other handicapping news, the biggest favorite of Week 12 is not a powerhouse, not the Patriots, not the Falcons, not the Jets, but a 3-7 team. Yes, the Cleveland Browns. The Browns are favored by more than a touchdown for only the third time since their return to NFL play in 1999 and they're double-digit favorites for only the second time in that span. While the Browns have been far more competitive this year, they're only 4-5-1 against the spread this season, and they failed to cover in their last two games. That said, Carolina is far worse. They're 2-8 against the spread, 1-9 overall, and 1-3 against the spread on the road this season. For even more handicapping information, check us out on the web at profootballweekly.com.